Hi everyone, today I'm going to talk about how to transfer your files from your computer to the World Wide Web so that they're live on your website. Um, to do that, we use a piece of software called FTP, which is File Transfer Protocol. There are tons of different FTP programs out there and ways to transfer. I'm going to use one called CyberDuck because it's free, it's easy to use, it's also available on Mac and PC, um, and it's open source, which I love. Um, so, you know, when you're transferring files to something through FTP, you know, one of the things I want you to think about when you're using a program called CyberDuck um, is transferring files to the web is no different than really transferring files to, say, your Dropbox account or your Google Drive or, you know, Microsoft OneDrive, anything like that. It's really no different of a process. Um, but we need a bridge to bridge the gap. We, you know, you can't just put the files on your web server um, unless you have something called FTP to do that. So we're going to use CyberDuck. CyberDuck will look and function very similar to Dropbox. It's no different. We're really just taking a file from one folder and dragging it to another. I'm going to show you how it works. I've already installed CyberDuck on this computer and I've logged in. So the first thing that I want to do though is I need to have a web page, right? I need to have some kind of web page. So I have Dreamweaver right here. I have Dreamweaver open. I call this Dr. Pastor's testing site. Very simple website, right? I'm going to create a folder on my desktop. I'm going to call this folder class test 3. All right, I've called a folder class test three. I'm going to go into Dreamweaver and I'm going to save my website to that folder. Save as, I'm going to find the folder. Let's see here. Desktop, class test three, save. We'll call this index.html so that it shows up as the first page. Now, I could save. 30 different sites to this class test folder. I've just saved one. I've just closed Dreamweaver. I just have one file in here, but I could have images. I could have 20 different files in this class test three folder. I just have one though to make this example easy. Now, I'm gonna log into CyberDuck, which I've already done, so it's already open, but just to show you how to log into CyberDuck, you know, you go to it on your computer, you, Click on connection if this doesn't pop up. You type in your server name. You type in your username, which your web company should give you, and your password, which your web company should give you. You click connect, and voila, you're in. You should see www. That's your main, you know, um, that's the main <coughs> place where you're going to install things. You know, I could change that, but we don't want to. There's no reason to do that. Um, all that I'm going to do to use CyberDuck to put my files from my computer to the World Wide Web is I am going to take this folder class test and just drag it right in here. That's it. Upload complete. Class test 3 is completed. Now, I'm going to go to my browser and let's test it raypastor.com backslash class test three right it's going to be my website with a slash whatever that name of that folder is and look it works perfect this site is live on the world wide web my testing site that's it's very easy to do the, the point of ftp and using some program folks is simply transferring a folder or a file from one place to another thank you